Take out all the Juice Daddy 2-in-1 juicer and blender parts and place them on a table. Do not plug in the juicer while assembling it. Unclamp the latches that hold the cover in place. Remove the cover. Remove the round cardboard protector. Use the end of the wipe brush as a wedge and gently but firmly remove the straining basket from the juice bowl. Lift the bowl off the juicer. Wash all these parts in your sink. The pulp container does not need to be washed. First remove all juicer parts from the juicer base. Pull the clamps backwards. Place the blender jar on top of the juicer motor with the handle turned at any angle where the arrows line up at the base. Place the rubber lid on top of the blender. Now you are ready to go. The blender works like all other standard blenders. Put what you want to blend into the container. Make sure the top is securely closed. Blend away. Place the juice bowl onto the juicer motor. Center it with the spout. Firmly place the straining basket into the juice bowl until it snaps. Make sure the straining basket can move freely. Turn the cover over. Find the white peg protruding from the underside. Match the white peg to the small black hole located on the juicer bowl. Place the clamp securely over the top of the cover. They will click in. Now you are ready to start juicing. Put fruit or vegetables into the juicer opening and use the plunger to push through. It is a good idea to put three or more carrots in at a time when juicing. One alone will often just spin around. Be careful not to put oversized whole apples through the opening. They may get stuck. Most importantly, unplug your juicer. Your pulp can go into the compost pile if you have a garden. Unclamp the latches that hold the cover in place. See all the pulp here? Lift the cover off. Turn the cover upside down and place in the sink. Using the end tip of the white brush, Snap the straining basket out. Place the straining basket into the sink. Lift the juice bowl with both hands and take to the sink. I use my juicer several times a day so I usually just clean it with warm water. Use the white brush to clean the straining basket. 
Never leave your juicer plunger to soak in the sink as it will fill up with water, possibly causing mildew problems over a period of time. Use a Q-tip to get at the hard to reach places. Hand wipe the juicer motor. Never immerse it in water. At the end of the day, I give all the parts except the juicer motor a good soaping. You can also put the parts in an automatic dishwasher. With your Juice Daddy 2-in-1 is our 48-page booklet, which includes my personal favorite juicing tonics, smoothies, and digestive aids. Our 7-day super diet for super health. Vitamin mineral chart for juicing your produce. Juice combining tips. How to clean and store your produce and many other tips and ideas to make the most of your juicing experience. If you want to know more about how juicing can transform your life as it has mine for the last 62 years, may I suggest you consider our Living Health Program, which includes our Live Foods, Live Bodies book, my favorite A to Z remedy book, two one-hour DVDs on juicing, five CDs, and our new DVD entitled Juice Daddy, all juiced up.